Okay, yeah, it's corruption. It's always corruption or miasma. Find a way to purge it. I don't know, dude. Hit it. Ah! It's defending itself somehow. Tango Gameworks' logo is not very Tango Gameworks-y, is it? It's a little strange. It's a little strange for a logo that looks like it should belong on some, like, free-to-play cartoon garbage. That uh, They make something like Ghostwire Tokyo, or The Evil Within, for that matter. Hey, it's Matt, and I'm, I'm, I'm trepidatious of, of playing Ghostwire today because people have opinions. Um, this game seems to be a little divisive among some people. Some people are like, this is great. Other people are like, wow, this is kind of really limiting and frustrating and repetitive, uh, which was a little bit worrying when uh, my girl, my queen, Ikumi Nakamura, just suddenly left this project, having been the creative director for a while, and she just quit the whole thing. And now she's doing her own uh, shit somewhere else. So it was a little concerning for me when Akumi Nakamura, my girl, um, just suddenly quit this whole project, just left it high and dry. Just like, no, I'm done. Well, well before it was, uh, you know, being finished. So that was strange. Um, now she's doing her own thing. Uh, bless her. Um, so yeah, I don't know what that means for Ghostwire Tokyo, but we'll find out. I do know there's cats and dogs, and that's what I'm here for. Oh, geez, we're playing The World Ends With You now. That's always what I think of. I'm assuming this is that was ghost vision. Like, we're looking down on people just living their lives. Mm, interesting. Mind Jack! This is just a remake of Mind Jack now. You all can't get it out of your head. Oh, the blinking thing. I don't like that because that, that reminds me of something else. Alone in the Dark. Inferno. So what I am thankful for is that the initial trailers of this game and gameplay it made it look like you're just a generic creative character and you didn't really have any story urgency. Like story was going to be de-emphasized and this was more of like a almost live service thing. Uh, thankfully it's not the case and the story does indeed seem to be pretty personal uh, with like character motivations and such which is what I want. It's not great. Your screams are justified, sir. Black tarry ooze floating out of your one's eyeballs. It's not great. Oh, here come the youths. Daijobu, you have a lot of um, evil seeping out of your skull there, sir. Masaka. Ah, uh, that would be youth punks and you have to beat them up like this just turns into a Yakuza game. It's me, Ghostwire. Oh, those dudes are still running. We're actually following them. Okay. Ah, oh, the fog, the remake, and the original. No. Where were you when the fog wave hit Tokyo? Yeah, yeah, the ghost can't see see you there. You're basically invisible. Lots of people, lots of ghosts are very concerned about getting wet. Um, also, there's many that are headless. Th those are less concerned about getting rained on. That dude's cool. Dead sack! Solid promo. Not too bad. He's getting the match across. Blah, 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 this Sunday. 
Oh, he's taking all the geists and putting them into game cubes. They actually look a little like game cubes. Yeah, looks like the party's over. Let's get going, everybody. Buffet closes at nine. Oh, there's a big one there. Is that Guardian Ape from Sekiro? What was that? That was interesting. <laughs> what the shit was that? Yeah. I always prefer the hard way. <laughs> I mean, dude, this still doesn't help you, Ghost Man, Ghost Wire. He should choke his own hand. That's what he's... Choke your hand out. It's, we still didn't really... Okay, go, go. Where we go, like... Didn't really sort of hash that out. Anyway, that's pretty cool. Uh, game looks pretty spooky. I like all the effects. I guess I can work with moving around. Wow, it's like already like a cutscene. Like it's just Slender Man. Is Slender Man a thing in Japan, or are they just like borrowing his appearance? There's a lot of Slender Men. The Slender Man Three Amigos. Like, what is this? Okay, cool. Let's attack these guys. Just shoot lasers at Slender Man. Okay, I have lasers for my fingers. You guys have umbrellas. Ellas. Ellas. Map. Okay. That's not a very good map. <laughs> I don't know if it's supposed to be that corrupted. I get. We'll just walk into a straight line. I'm sure we'll get there. Do I have a run? Yes, I do. Man, these are these streets are rain slicked. Ooh, Boo Boo Burger! Love me some Boo Boo. That looks totally real. Wonder where America Town is. Oh, there's that big crab place I always see all the time. This big crab, Joe's Crab Shack, I believe it's called. Cold and scones. <laughs> yeah, some cold and scones. Oh my god, this is an adorable character. It tastes like magic, I'm sure it does. Can't go down here because of a literal evil fog. Keep clear of that fog. All right, that's that's the kryptonite fog that's keeping us. And Tullator Bucks. <laughs> what? That's a mouthful. You gotta get rid of this bad vibes. Oh, just hitting it with my fist. Okay. <laughs> Don't use my magic. Hit it with my fist. Ether and crystallize. Either you'll come across crystallize. Either that can be destroyed by ethereal weaving or with strike attacks. Doing silver shadow deposit. Uh, energy perform attacks. Defeating visitors will also produce ether. Okay, visitors they're called. That's what, that's what we're calling the scary ghosts. Look at this badass, no parking, and he's just like, I'm gonna park where I want. Whether it's in English or Japanese or whatever, no one understands parking regulation signs. No one. You can't convince me otherwise. Kapow. Okay. I guess these are just like uh, things to break, like, you know, your barrels, uh, boxes, crates, that type of stuff. Ooh. Oh, look at, that, look at that can of frenzy. More precarious. Nice and camu. Oh my god, is that just... That, that's the, the guy, the guy from the anime that I don't watch. Yeah, I doubt Shinji Mikami is, is watching this, but if he is, tell, tell Kamiya to unblock me and everyone else on Twitter. It's getting real bad. It's a, the soul is always beyond saving every time you, you kind of encounter these scenarios. Toggle Crouch. Well, we just can't fight them. Oh, there are going to be sneak attacks? Let's hope so. Do a little quick purge. Yeah, I like how snappy the animations are. Ooh, big levels. Skill points 10, are you insane? You get, I bring in that synergy all the time, accruing the XP. Uh, we'll give you XP, therefore you can do the modern video game stuff. Oh, that costed all my, all my skill points. That was 10, just for that, so I guess we gain skill points a lot. 
I miss the green gel from Evil Within, in all honesty. Uh, wind Weaver knows. Okay, that's just the, the normal attack. Speed boost, shoot faster. More speed boost, more speed boost. You're not ready. You're just not ready. Matt, you are you are always on level one. Oh. And I can't even see regular abilities so that... Oh, wait. There, there's some down here. Faster sneaking. Uh, uh, Ether Shakedown. Mr. Shakedown returns. Perfect block. Cool. Ground core grab. That's pretty neat. All right, we're gonna get to Mari's room. So I know this is gonna be weird, but this does remind me like a bit of the hospital level in Juan the Grudge, the haunted house simulator for the Wii. Look and listen, message to family, family, don't worry, mom, I'm in the hospital. I think it'll be okay. Uh, I hope they made it. Can't go up there. It'd be cool if like random, you could see random ghosts doing scary, like, you know, in, in Fatal Frame, you'll just see a ghost doing something like innocuous, just like walking or whatever. I have no, I have not read anything about whether this game is actually, like, it has jump scares or, like, you know, tense atmo anywhere. Like, it's kind of presented as an action game with, like, a vague horror theme. Oh, it's getting real dark down there. So, I'm assuming what this is like is, like, in other, like, Japanese scary games, like, most of these ghosts are based on urban legends. Like, it's the girl with the missing head and the guys that really love umbrellas. Um, that type of stuff. I hope there's not, like, a ghostly version of Hachiko. Ugh. So it's very Ghostbusters-esque a little bit, right? Throwing out a trap. Wow, that's, that was way too many effects. Uh, just, like, kind of a, uh, attacking the characters so they're a little bit weaker and then kind of reeling them in with a trap. I mean, it makes sense because... You can't kill ghosts, believe me, I've tried. Uh, so your best bet is to like just weaken them and you're trapping them essentially somewhere in a pocket dimension, you know, in a mine prison. What you got? Uh, noise complaint, low water pressure, flowers came from brother, needs vase. Yeah, it just, it's weird that they're cataloging these notes away. Okay, this looks good. Uh, so you may be wondering what this black ooze in my face is. Don't worry, Mary. I can explain. So why would he think she was here when everyone else in the world has disappeared? Oh, well, fuck me. We're gonna be fighting Rom the vacuous mental patient here? Concentrated power of will, 5% pleasure, 50% pain. Let, let, left it open so you guys can uh, complete it in the comments. You're just talking bollocks, man. What the hell are you saying? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. Astral Chain? Oh, so these are all bosses with scary faces. Wow, that mask is very evil within. Might want to remove her from those wires. Okay, it just, it just happened. I like those guys' sneakers. You always need a cutscene like that to establish your villain, and that did a good job. Did we drown in the milk? Z Yakuza puffs. <laughs> it's the favorite puffs of the Yakuza. So I kind of would have preferred if there was actual, like, people around every so often. Maybe there will be, but, like, when the city is completely empty and, and lifeless, it's kind of empty and lifeless, you know what I mean? Like, I, that's not my favorite thing in the world. It's not that interesting to go through. Uh, yeah, yellow ether crystals, which will be many cases you can out. see that uh, they were already available. Miko and Shattered. Okay, so uh, another resource, I guess. Um, because, like, you know, one thing about, you know, th this, this section of Tokyo is that, you know, especially through the lens of the Yakuza games, is that you realize how much life there is in it and seeing it you know, with, with zero life is kind of not as engaging. Like, you want to save people as you're going through this. So I wonder if I can sneak attack him. Oh, shit, maybe not. No, you know, he he, he, he sees me. Oh, look at his little fast walk! Jack it up, action man! Oh! Oh, 
I, I, do I have like a... I have a jump, so that's something, but I kind of was hoping for a dodge. Zoom this up. I want to do the block again. Oh, perfect blocking! Uh, 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 parrying attack without taking any damage whatsoever. Okay. That was pretty cool. Whoa! Maybe they're good here. Really? I heard. I did you guys hear that? Uh, Kaguga Suza, a series of bells affixed to a small road which are rung by Shinto shrine maidens as they perform ritualistic uh, Kagura dances. I heard a dog. I fucking heard it. <gasps> oh! Uh, oh! I want it! Oh no! Uh. <laughs> Getting too excited. What's the problem, little buddy? Probably some invisible ghost shit. Like that. Oh, maybe we can save people. They're locked in the game cubes. That's better. Still time to save them. Yeah. Now we gotta save them, man. Don't you touch the dog, sir. Sir. Yeah, get fucked. Ooh, 42 cute. So cute. Girls bar 42 cute. Man, I, I yeah, I read about that like Tokyo muscle girl bar where you like drink protein shakes and like like dance to music and all the girls there are like super muscled like Japanese like super athlete ladies. That shit's the sickest. Oh, I, there, this better be like a sub game like pet all the pets. Yeah, look at that entry. Animals of Shibuya! Unlike humans, animals have not vanished. Do I just never mind what I said before about oh no, I wish there were humans. No, there's just animals, that's the preferred city. You can use special vision to communicate with any local critters and see what they have to say. Holy shit, 10 out of 10 game here, folks. Why is your butthole so red, sir? You gotta take care of that. Pet him again, why not? A human meow in my shop. I've got lots of stuff I can trade for Mew for it. Have a look, Mew. Oh my god. Um, so I can get one more of these. I actually have, yeah, a lot. Dog food. Uh, processed food made for canines. Maybe you should give it to a dog. Yes, I will. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's, uh, how do we do this? Photo mode? No, absolutely not. Uh, inventory. Ooh. Uh, drinks, food, spectral food. Okay, where's my doggy treat? Yakuza Puffs, a brandified sent by a type of Japanese rice cracker. Rice ball, no. Three cotton dog. A snack for me. Shape then frying it. Where's the dog food? Go over to my mad skills. Uh, so faster sneaking. Ether shakedown causes ether to appear when hitting enemies with strike attacks. Oh, so you just, you literally get XP out of him as you hit him. Uh, causes ether to appear when successfully performing a perfect block. Uh, so you can speed that up. Ground uh, allows you to use quick purge on down enemies. That seems really good, like really useful. Ground attack boost. Oh, and you can shoot them while they're on the ground. All right. Melee core grab lets you directly grab and crush enemy cores at close range. Ooh. Cannot be interrupted by enemy attacks. Uh, yeah, I'll open that. Seems like weapons, right? Oh, yes, it is. Wow. It's like a ghost bow and arrow. What is this? <laughs> All right, we've got a weapon now. Time to move. Let's do it. I got a weapon. Wait, I have to look at your dirty dishes. And right now, just KK, put the utensils away, throw out the empty food containers. Get the kitchen cleared up before I get back, you slob. Yo, give me some comments if uh, you were slobbing it down and, and you know, going straight into goblin mode. We all are. It's too far away. Put an arrow through it. Okay. Equip the bow. Yeah. This is so weird. Oh, is that? An, that's not it. Oh, that's it. Okay. Uh, did I do it? No, I didn't do it. Ah! I got a cleanse. Keep cleansing my heart away. 
Oh, I gotta absorb all these motherfuckers, too. Whoo, corruption and spirits. That was, that was a lot. Oh. What are you now? <gasps> it's another kitty! No, no, I don't care about this bit. There's a cat right there. Where is he? Where'd he go? Hey, yo, read thoughts! <gasps> I'm in a bad mood. That is accurate to a cat! Get away, boxes! Out of the way! I'm trying to pet a cat. No, I think I think I need um I think I need cat food or something. Is he still in a bad mood? He's in a bad mood. Ah! Uh, well, that is a little look at Ghostwire Tokyo. I'm actually really digging this. I, I can see it maybe getting repetitive down the line if you're just always on the streets of Tokyo, just doing the same sort of things, collecting spirits, busting stuff open, and, and just doing combat. Like, I'm pretty sure you stay here the entire game. Like, there's not, you know, any other places you visit. But, I mean, Tokyo is in the... Okay, Tokyo is in the name of the game, so I don't know. I, I like to play a bit more of this, but let me know what you thought in the comments, and I'll see if I can find any more cats and dogs for you.